Well, guys, I have big news. Uh oh. Um, what is this big news? Apparently, uh, Phil the groundhog saw, yeah. saw his shadow. Oh no! Which means more winter. Oh yay! That's good. More snow days. Why couldn't you see his shadow yesterday? Um, he's on the groundhog has only not seen his shadow fifteen times in this groundhog's history, in Phil's history. Um, CNN meteorologist. Chad Myers had to try to ruin the fun. Oh, um, what did Chad do? Wait a minute. Hold on. Let me back up. I'm not surprised that someone named Chad <laughs> tried to ruin the fun. But go ahead. He said that Phil, the groundhog, is only r- right 39% of the time. Oh, so screw no- you, Chad. So nobody should pay attention to that. <laughs> really? Come on, Chad. What the hell? Don't be calling out the groundhog. like. Don't be calling out Phil like that. Well, how about just go ahead and tell the kids Santa Claus is Chad don't a exist. meteorologist? Chad's a meteorologist. <laughs> uh, how yeah. often is Chad right? He's a CNN meteorologist. Yeah, how often is Chad right? Let's look at his <laughs> yeah. numbers. Let's see how often Chad gets it right. If it's going to rain or not. If right. there's going to be six more weeks of winter. That's true. You know, if you're going to call people out, Chad, <laughs> especially, I guess it's a rodent. Would it be a rodent? Would it is a groundhog yeah, a rodent? Think, yeah, he'd be okay. like a big rat. <laughs> yeah. Well, Especially if you're going to call out rodents, you know? Mm-hmm. Do you know the tradition behind Groundhog Day? No clue. Uh, basically, it goes back to medieval times. There was a superstition that hibernating animals would come out of their caves and dens, and uh, they would check the weather, which is, they would always check right halfway between the winter solstice and in December and the, the equinox in March. And basically, seeing their shadow would mean winter would go on another six weeks so they could go back to sleep. But anyway, yeah, that interesting stuff about Groundhog Day. Sorry those guys had to be jerks and... Ruin it for everyone. Somebody in one of the comments, um, after they put that he has no predictive skill, somebody put, what's his prediction on health care (laughs) reform? That pisses me off. How dare. So six more weeks of winter, guys. How dare a weatherman critique another weatherman? That's... That's like if you gotta steal the thunder, don't you, buddy? Say yeah, jumping in. Oh well, well, uh, well, watch CNN because you know that groundhog's yeah. only thirty nine percent accurate. You know what? That's I'm what I'm like. not gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna openly. It's like how uh, MCs battle in rap. Yeah, but y- they're battling one another. Al Roker's banging on Larry Phil Sprinkle. The, this is Phil the <laughs> Groundhog, though. This is Phil the, yeah. the groundhog. But you're right. It's it is. It's like if I was a weatherman and I dissed Larry Sprinkle. <laughs> right. I mean, you can't you can't do that. Larry Sprinkle. Like, oh, well, Larry's only right 36 percent of the time. What was it? 30, 37? 39. Larry's yeah. not even a meteorologist. Yeah. yeah, Larry's not even right yeah, half the time. <laughs> he's just a weather guy. He didn't go to school for meteorology. Yeah. Hmm. Oh well. I'm sure they. Yeah, I'm sure that goes on. You know what? Mm-hmm. I don't watch CNN now, and I'm not gonna now. I mean, <laughs> anytime you bash something that doesn't even have a chance to defend itself, I, see that's. What <laughs> I mean, really, that's like making fun of like a three year old. They're it not gonna is. be able to defend themselves. That's that's poor on your part, Chad. That I'm, is. You know what? I'm Chad. gonna start. A, I'm gonna start a Facebook fan page against this guy. Yeah, Chad said the groundhog was inaccurate. <laughs> no, what's let's it? boycott Chad. What's his name, Chad? What? Dang it! I left the story already. He's a meteorologist from CNN, Chad. <laughs> I'll try to get back to his name in a minute. But yeah, that's my Facebook page is going to be Chad from CNN's a douchebag. I mean, you probably don't. Chad, really the care. weather guy from CNN. No, not at this point. No. Let's see. All right, hold on. It makes me ill. Ugh. That bad? Yeah. It's just like Wilson said. One, no chance to defend itself. I mean, Phil. Phil can't defend himself. What's Phil going to say? It's Chad Myers. M- Chad Myers. M E. I'm I'm writing it down. It's M E Y E R S. M E Y E R S. All right, Myers. Chad Myers. You're on my list. Myers. Well, Phil just needs to be right. That's all. You know, Chad Prove needs wrong. Chad needs to learn a little respect. <laughs> is what needs to happen. You know what I think well, it is? I think Chad's not had a good ass whooping lately. I think like, that's probably what's going on. It's like when your grandparents or the elderly tell you a story or tell you how to do something <clears> and you know it's the wrong way. But you just kind of out of courtesy. Oh, okay. Yeah. Or you know there's an easier way to do it. Um, but, yeah, out of courtesy, you just, I mean, it's respect. Respect the groundhog. 
Respect the shadow. Chad Myers, it's me and you, buddy. That's what I'm going to put as my status. Respect the shadow. <laughs> respect the shadow. That's right. It was there. Respect it. Yeah. Six. I firmly believe there will be six more weeks of winter yeah. now. Because what do you predict? What? Come on, Chad. What are you predicting? <laughs> It's going to be sunny the rest of the week, huh? <laughs> Let's hear what you have to say about our weather in our neck of the woods. Oh, I'm know mad. And the, I'm ill now. <laughs> and the groundhog's just making like a general statement over everybody. Yeah. He's predicting it for the nation. Yeah. <laughs> so chill out, Chad Myers. Chad Myers. We'll be back. What a jerk. <laughs>